My name is David Brevik, and I am President and CEO of Gazillion. I did Diablo and Diablo 2. I've come here to Gazillion to do the Marvel Heroes game. I'm a huge Marvel fan. We wanted to make something very different than the other MMOs. Most MMOs, you create your own character, and oftentimes you do not know who these people are, and uh, they don't have any backstory and any kind of relationships with other characters, and so it loses a lot of the depth. We're combining the, an action game, an action RPG, with an MMO, which has really never been done before. And so taking those two things creates a unique experience that's very different than other things. And then to top it off, it's all going to be free, which is just absurd. So we have lots of locations and objects that people are familiar with in, when they read Marvel comics. We have places like the Savage Land and Hell's Kitchen and Sinister's Lab, many locations that we've read and known and loved. If we take that to the next level and we've got randomness thrown in, which really creates this sense of exploration and discovery that makes a fresh experience every single time you play it. So we didn't decide on just doing one look. Because we have access to all of these characters, we also have access to all of these costumes. Take Spider-Man, for instance. Spider-Man has had his new Future Foundation costume. He has Iron Spider that Iron Man made him. He has black suit. You know, it, it, there are many, many suits that he's had over the years. And to take all of those and put those into a game that allows this customization, and allows you to choose which suit you have, is going to be very compelling. We're telling a majority of the story through motion comics. The motion comics are being drawn by a variety of Marvel artists. It's very exciting, and the story, of course, is being written by Brian Michael Bendis. I think that Marvel fans will find the story extremely compelling, and you can let your imagination run wild with the kind of damage that Doctor Doom can do with the cube. And this isn't just an Avengers game or an X-Men game or something like that. We have access to all the characters in the Marvel Universe, which makes this a really unique game. To learn more information about what we're doing, I suggest visiting MarvelHeroes.com or following us on Facebook.